is the yes? Is that something that you repeat? Yeah, the, the yes to, to decrease resistance is more a preparation for, for uh, meditation, right? Uh, you are decreasing resistance, the mind is getting quieter, and, uh, and then you hopefully will, uh, will use a pointer like resting as awareness and you will defocus from everything. You can, you can use the word yes even during the day to decrease resistance and sometimes just saying it once will bring you there because you will begin to recognize the state of non-resistance. So you say to yourself yes and it triggers, you know, the state that you, are, that you already recognized as non-resistance, right? So in the beginning I use it the way, as a, almost like a technique, with e each exhalation you, you repeat yes, uh, then you repeat yes, you can do it also when you see mental objects arising, you kind of hang the yes to them right, so that you don't resist them. But eventually you want to just uh, rest, because meditation is a, a resting, is a state of resting. And it's, not, it's not a state of doing, it's a state of beingness. And uh, if we, the, the, the med any meditation technique can put us into the doing, right? I am doing meditation, and that's not meditation. Meditation is a beingness state. I felt such peace, you know, and that doesn't happen all the time, but right. if I can let go and just rest, like you said. Yeah. Yes. <clears throat> now, the beingness, <clears throat> see what uh, what Mindy is saying, just for the sake of the recording, that because I don't know if he's picking up your words, mm -hmm. but um, what Mindy is saying is that um, Somewhere you read about that wherever you are, wherever you go, there, wherever you go, there you are, yeah. right? So it's it's um, in a way in a way it's a pointer to the essential fundamental fact of beingness, beingness, right? That uh, beingness is constant. That's why wherever you go, there you are, from the verb to be, right? So, um, this beingness is constant. Everything else is coming and going, right? You always are, but your thoughts are coming and going. You are, uh, your feelings are coming and going. Sensations are coming and going. Desires are coming and going. All the mental objects are coming and going. But you always are. So, your isness is the only constant. And isness as an awareness are the same. Isness, in a way, is awareness, and awareness is isness. Mm -hmm. Right? So, awareness is equally constant to isness. And the pointers in non duality that point to beingness or isness are different, but in a way they are pointing to the same thing, to your true nature, right? To the beingness, which is that beingness is independent of your name, independent of your um, position in life, independent of your um, gender, independent of everything practically, right? is that isness is constant and solid and it has been always has also been called the ground of being so you can ground yourself into beingness right and you can use this beautiful pointer uh, to do that to to feel that isness, because that isness can be noticed again, same as awareness can be noticed, isness can be noticed, yeah, and then you are grounding yourself in that beingness, and the pointer that you use is um, the ground 
the ground of beingness or the ground of being and 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 then you just follow the pointer into that which is not mind is the solid isness like a rock that never goes away right very pleasant right so Nisargadatta calls this the I am right the feeling of I am the feeling of I am is, is a ground it has a grounding effect because the mind is not grounding in fact the mind is ungrounding us it's pulling us into our into our, our clouds right into the clouds not into our root which is bigness so that's why um, being grounded means being in bigness so let's uh, try this point right um, basically uh, just uh, close your eyes for a moment and go into the ground of being into the ground of beingness or the ground of being forget the clouds and ground yourself into what is real in you You can also use the pointer I am until you feel that I amness that is solid. Okay, so that was for you, Gina. I invented a t-shirt that I'm going to have made up that says, I am minding my own isness. <laughs> ah, minding my own isness. Beautiful. I am minding my own isness. So for those who will watch this video, you can call Gina and buy, a <laughs> buy the shirt from her. TM trademark. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it had a feeling of solidity to it. Solidity, Where, right? Yeah. Whereas most of the other techniques are very spacious, this still kind of was that, but there was more right. being in that. Very good. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> See, it's getting rid of the clouds. <laughs>